The officers pulled up. They had no idea they were going to run into a gun battle. Breaking news as we come on the air tonight, a shootout between a person and Columbus police on the city's far east side. Thanks for joining us tonight at 11. I'm Colin Dorsey. It happened on McAllister Avenue near the Whitehall city limits, and that's where we find 10 TV's Carly Dion. She was the first one at the scene tonight and has been there all evening. She's live for us now. Carly, what have you learned? Yeah, Colin, the scene here behind me on McAllister Avenue still very active at this time and neighbors I spoke with tell me they heard a lot of gunfire during the incident. Now, a short while ago, I spoke with executive vice president of the Fraternal Order of Police, Sergeant Brian Toth. He tells me when police arrived at the scene, they were met with gunfire by a suspect who was heavily armed. Police were called to the scene around seven this evening. Toth says at least one officer returned gunfire. He also also confirmed at least one person is dead. He adds this started from a domestic situation. Some neighbors I spoke with tonight say they were outside at the time the gunfire broke out. Here's what Toth had to say about that. Police officers arrived. They were met with gunfire by the suspect and the suspect left them no, no other alternative but to return fire to save their own lives. Now, we've also been told Columbus Police Homicide and the Bureau of Criminal Investigation are investigating this incident and we're lurking, working to learn more at this time. Columbus Police actually just told, told us in a short while they're going to come and see us and give us some more information. But for now, Colin, I'll send it back to you. All right, Carly, thank you. We are going to continue following this breaking story for you tonight. As we learn more, we'll keep you updated on air, online and at the 10 TV app, or you can get push alerts right to your smartphone. It's free to download in your phone's app store.